friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Amanda and thank you so much for watching. Today I am bringing you my Americana summer front porch. I'm just starting off with a quick clean first, but I do want to apologize really quick for the kind of crazy lighting. We have been having a very busy couple of weeks here at our house. My oldest son James had two field trips with his preschool over the past two weeks, as well as two birthday parties, and I feel like I have also been taking us all over King them come running errands too. So the only time I could film this was mid afternoon and our house is south facing, which means we've got some late afternoon sunshine pouring onto just half the porch. After I cleaned, I had to spray for spiders. If you've watched any of my other front porch videos, you'll know that I always talk about how spiders are super common on our porch since we live opposite a protected wetland area. Usually I only spray in the fall and springtime, but our neighbors recently had their house sprayed, so we have been seeing a few more around our house than usual. There are some webs on the Adirondack chair as well, which is why I spray it super heavily. I just really hate spiders. <laughs> I just want to take a quick second here to welcome you to the channel if you're new and welcome you back if you're returning. Thank you so much for taking time out of your busy day to watch this video. It really means a lot to me. If you're enjoying it, be sure to hit that thumbs up to let me know and please consider subscribing as well if you haven't already. Now I will link the items that I use in this video down below if you're interested, but if I happen to forget something that you want to know more about, definitely leave a comment down below and I will be sure to answer. I love hearing your thoughts down in the comments in general and chatting with you all, so I do my best to respond to everyone. I decided to keep the welcome mat and rug the same as what I had out during the spring. As they say, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And I think that fits our family especially well right now since we are on a budget and I'm sure many of you are too.
Oftentimes, I will just leave these lanterns empty if I don't have enough filler to put inside, which I rarely do. But I had some battery-powered candles that I no longer use in the house, so I just added some ribbon to them to add a little bit of Americana flavor, I guess, and place them inside the lanterns. I think it'll look really pretty on late nights to have them lit up. Do you know I'm looking and I can't help but smile? Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on, I put my feet up, and we just sing along, and I can't help but feeling just loving. And after adding the pillow to the chair and the wreath to the front door, that is all for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, be sure to hit that thumbs up if you haven't already. I will see you all in my next video. Bye for now. Thank you.